Today we're going to show you how to shop and earn rewards using Ibotta. Ibotta is a really cool application that lets you go on your normal uh, grocery store visit, go shopping, and earn rewards from things you might already buy anyways. It's a really great way to earn a little bit of cash back, and it's pretty fun too. I'm going to show you how to do it right now. First, go into Safari and type in bit.ly slash get Ibotta. That's get I-B-O-T-T-A. The link's right here on the screen and also in the description. What you're going to do is you're going to scroll down and you're going to create an account right here on the website. Now you can either sign in with Facebook, Google, or email, and that way you can create an account so you can redeem all of the different gift cards that you could earn. Now it's very important that you fill out all this information correctly because once you do earn the gift card, they need to know your email address, your name, and all of that information. And also another really important part is your zip code. That way they know the best uh, stores that are near you to give you deals. And there's a lot of stores in on this already. Stop and Shop, uh, CVS, Walmart. A lot of these stores are already in the Ibotta um, circuit with all their different stuff. So you're gonna be sent a confirmation email. So you just wanna open up uh, whatever email client you have. Just click confirm your account. Um, and that way your account is all confirmed and all set to go. It's pretty easy and simple just to do that. And then once you're done with that, it's gonna say congratulations. You can just scroll down and then you'll find a link to the app store where you can download the Ibotta app. So you're just gonna download the application and uh, once it's done downloading, you'll sign in with your credentials you just created. Now, I definitely like Ibotta. I think it's a lot better than uh, Checkpoints, in my personal opinion, because you can earn a lot more cash back and you're able to uh, cash out a lot quicker uh, than some things like Checkpoints. So as you can see here, we're just loading up I Ibotta and it's got some Ibotta 2.0 uh, features. They've added a lot of totally revamped features into the newer version. But basically this just just show you a tutorial that we're already kind of showing you here today. But basically you go to restaurants or you go to uh, grocery stores, you buy products, take a couple of polls, and then you get rewards from that. And it's very easy and very fast to do. So as you can see, there's a lot of stores in my area that um, have this offer. If you look at Walmart here, you can get People Magazine, Earn a Dollar. Um, these are things you might already be buying. Uh, mac and cheese, uh, basically a lot of really cool products that they just want to advertise that you might already be buying anyways, like Kool-Aid. I'm sure a lot of you guys buy Kool-Aid out there. So there's a lot of really great products that you can actually earn with. So I found this uh, multi-grain uh, Wesa cracker thing and um, as you can see we can take a poll for 29 cent, uh, 25 cents and as you can see I just answered um, that I haven't bought this product before. Uh, you can take um, a little trivia quiz. So Wasa crisp breads are which of the following. So you can look at this and kind of try and figure it out. So I scrolled down, I found out that it's probably all of the above, all the natural ingredients, all that stuff. You're an additional 25 cents. You can like it on Facebook, earn 50 cents. Now you don't get this all instantly. It hinges on you actually purchasing the product. So once you've added all the different things in your checklist, done the polls, watched the videos, you can redeem it just by clicking redeem at Walmart. And all you have to do is take a picture of your receipt. And the way this allows you to get better rewards than checkpoints is this actually makes sure you purchase the product as opposed to just see it on the shelf. So they're able to give you a lot more rewards for not that much effort and there's a lot of great products you would buy anyways. I was scrolling through this and I realized I buy a lot of this stuff anyways and I could be earning more back on this than I could be earning with coupons. So as you can see, there's a lot of different stores. They also have restaurants. I haven't found a ton of restaurants yet, but the grocery stores are pretty cool. And um, I just found this, and I think it's really great for the holiday shopping. Now, you can actually earn up to $10 with uh, the welcome bonus. We'll show you that in just a second. But I'm just going to show you one more here. As you can see, if you go to Chili's, a restaurant, you can take a quick poll or trivia test and learn a fact here. Just for 50 cents, you can learn a fact about... Um, some of the different things that they make and then by redeeming it all you have to do is take a picture of the Chili's receipt and you'll get that money in your account. So as you can see here we'll look at the bonuses. You can get welcome bonuses and these are pretty cool because you can get a 250 bonus just by getting two offers in the first two weeks. Then if you do a total of five offers, you get another 250 on top of that. So by doing five offers, you get $5 on top of the around $5 you make from those offers. That's 10 bucks for only buying five things. Uh, so that's a pretty good deal. Then also if you buy five additional things on top of that, you make another $5. 
So as you can see, I've done it a little bit. My balance is already four bucks. You can cash out to PayPal once you hit five dollars, which is really easy, as you can see. Um, you can also get Regal Cinema, Starbucks, iTunes, and Redbox in here as well. Uh, but my favorite is definitely the PayPal and iTunes because those are things that I'd actually be using. It's definitely a really great service. I recommend checking it out. Um, be sure to use that exact link. Everything you need to know is down in the description. And let me know in the comments, do you like this kind of app? Do you think this is going to entice you to buy more products? Uh, and that's basically it, guys. Thank you for watching this video. Once again, I'm Eric from AppFind. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.